Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today's video is my Valentine's Day swap which I'm sending out to Norma. Um, we were both running a little bit late with our swap this year, um, so I'm not posting this video until she's received a swap, so it's probably way, way, way after Valentine's Day now, but I still wanted to film this video um, and share what I made. So I'm going to start off with... Um, my jelly tote bag because I absolutely love this. This is a new dye from Scrap Diva Designs for this Valentine's Day and I think it's so cute. It's a jelly bag and then it's got the love heart handles on it. I did mine in glitter card and then I've just decorated it with a little cluster of embellishments here. Um, I think I've got a video on my YouTube channel of actually making this as well. So inside I popped in this box of wire wrapped word embellishments and they're all Valentine's Day themed. And then I've also got this um, little bead mix which I made, all different Valentine's Day coloured beads. And then I've got this little roll of Valentine's Day tickets which are perfect for making Valentine's Day um, embellishments. So I'm sending that to her. Um, I better move it out of the way actually so I remember what I've shown and what I haven't. So I've got these little banner embellishments which I've made. Just a simple one and then this is a bag topper which um, Cheryl's made. Oh sorry I'm hitting you. <laughs> um, I've got these shaker embellishments as well. So I've got the little bubbles. Love this die. This is from KS Craft, and then also these little postage stamps. I made this phone, um, with a die from Scrap Diva Designs, um, and it's this is a phone case. So it comes with the case and then the phone inside. I think it's so cute. And I made both the phone and the case into shakers. And it's even got this shaker embellishment on, which Victoria made me last Valentine's Day. And I've got these little embellishments on the inside. I think it would look so cute with a little photo inside because it says besties. So Nana should definitely pop in a photo of her bestie in there and then keep it as a little decorative item. I think it turned out really cute and I definitely want to make some more of them. And I've got some more embellishments these are some little xoxo i've got some shaker ones and then some layered foam ones this was also another die from scrap diva designs which came out this valentine's day and then i've got these floral pretty floral embellishments which i've made as well different ones in there and i've got two packs of embellishments here as well so I've got these ones are the Shaker Heart Sunglasses. These are from KS Craft, another die. And then this one is some little mini bag toppers. Love decorating bag toppers. I've got some little treats. So I've got the Full of Heart Harry Bowls. And these Valentine's Day washi tapes. These are from DRK Crafts. Um, I've got some more handmade embellishments over here, so I've got some more flowers and I've got some pretty rosettes, I had so much fun making these. And then I've got these sweet treat embellishments, I've got donuts and milkshake. I made this little heart pocket. This is another Scrap Diva Designs die and I'm going to pop a little note inside of here on top of my parcel and also on top of my parcel I'm going to put this gorgeous like Cupid's bow arrow which Beck made last year and she used it on the packaging of my parcel which she sent me so I'm going to re-gift this because I think it's so pretty. And this little suitcase is also some packaging which 
um, Beck made me last year so I'm using this to package up some goodies so inside are some sequin mixes which I've made so I've got three different ones all got fun different clay pieces in them as well and I used lots of sequins from Cartwright sequins and then I've got this 3D project which is um, it's like a, a wardrobe <laughs> and like the fancy ones that you get in France um, I did make it as a box but I found it was quite a tight fit so I haven't put anything inside and I'm just sort of leaving it as a 3D project which you could just use to display. Um, so this is how I've decorated on the front. Oh, sorry, that was my speaker turning off by itself. So that's that one. This is another die from Scrap Diva Designs. And then I've just got a few more things left. So I've got some shop bought goodies which I'm sending. So I've got these pegs which I've got little love hearts on, so they're definitely good for Valentine's Day. These were from the range. I've got this little um flower die. This was from AliExpress. It's not really Valentine's Day, but um you always need flower dye, so why not? And then I've got these heart gems like very dimensional like little um, pearl ones and then I've got these sparkly dome gems as well personally I love gems so I love to share gems with crafty friends and then also from the works are these foam stickers in this really hot sparkly pink and then I found these in home bargains and they are rose gold heart letter stickers. So there's some shop for goodies which I've picked up to send her. And then last of all, I've got this box of embellishments. And I've repurposed this box because this is actually a sock box. And um, I've got some socks in it for Christmas, I think it was. So I just decorated um, some little stickers on the front to cover up the packaging. And then I already had these hearts cut out, which I thought was so perfect. So I just popped some shred inside so things don't fall out. And then I've just got some mini embellishments in here. So I've got these heart shakers and a little bowl. I've got these really cute cats. This is a new die from Kiss Craft this Valentine's. And then I've got these really cute popcorn shakers. So I'm going to package this all up and send it off to Nama and when you've seen this video she will have received it by then um, and I'm sure that I'll share a video of what Nama made for me as well. I hope that you've enjoyed watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.